So I'm a recreation therapist. I work in an adult inpatient unit in mental health and I do it because I love it. I love coming to work every day because every single day is different. There is never one day that is the same as the other and I get to do the greatest things. Sometimes we get so caught up in the day to day that we forget to take time out for ourselves. And if we can't look after ourselves to begin with, how are we gonna look after someone else? So leisure and recreation is anything that is freely chosen. It's something you do because you enjoy it. Nobody tells you you will enjoy music, right? You do it because you love it. And it's about using those things that give you purpose and meaning for something to get out of bed. And when someone doesn't engage in leisure and recreation or doesn't use it in a pro-social, healthy way, a lot of the times we find that people withdraw. They withdraw socially, they lose self-confidence and then don't want to go out into the world anymore. When a client first comes in, we'll do an assessment based on their leisure interests and their leisure needs. Also looking at barriers that they have and what stops them from doing the things that they enjoy. So we're looking at goals for the client and goals from the therapy perspective as well. We'll use art as therapy, uh, music as therapy, horticulture, physical exercise. I get to see a smile on clients' faces in an environment where they might not be so happy. I get to help them build those relationships and build their self-esteem and feel a sense of accomplishment. So yeah, I actually get a lot. <laughs> My experience at Western Sydney Uni was a unique one. I wasn't the most motivated student when I first started um, and because I had no idea what I wanted to do was kind of just going through the motions, doing my assignments and then that was it. The way the lecturers really got me hooked in was by challenging me and when I would choose an elective, why are you doing this? How is it going to relate to your future? They were really open and supportive to helping someone like me who didn't know what they wanted to do. Um, when I did my first placement in disabilities and my second placement in aged care and I thought, I don't know if this is the right field for someone like me, um, they were open to the ideas that I wanted to work somewhere different. I wanted different experiences in life. I wanted something challenging and exciting. So my final year, I said no to anything other than drug and alcohol or mental health and they accepted that challenge and I absolutely loved it. After that mental health placement I was like this is it. If I'm going to do something with the rest of my life 100% this is it. Think about where you want to be, think about what you want to do and definitely utilize your opportunities uh, for placement in a positive way. I challenged and I said this is the area I wanted to go to and Western Sydney met that and I think that's what they're passionate about too, helping students to their full potential. So I'm really excited for my fellow colleagues. <laughs>